uh, a migrant or transnational individual like you might be foreign wherever you go but at the end you connect with people who are on a similar vibe of yourself and that sort of connection is is different to just locational like locational connection right okay so LA stands for leave of absence the name of the space came around because I myself was absent from London where I received all my art education when UK replaced post-study work visa to working holiday visa in 2012 I had to leave UK the context of London I was absent from after a few years of thinking about how to fill that feeling of existing physically um, I thought about having this gallery space to also represent emerging artists who had a similar path as me so they probably came here to study for two to three years in my case I was studying for 10 years and um, there's no possibility to work to put the use of what we learn to see how it responds to society so leave of absence the name come about because of that like we are temporarily elsewhere but we are still there our thoughts are still there our influence our uh, connection are still there i was looking for a space for a few years in 2018 i found this like work live space in dalston we start nominating people we would like to invite them to show something in the gallery and there were this set of rules that we nominate someone that we know like a friend uh, nominate someone that we inspired by just an uh, artist that we want to get to know and the third one would be someone who doesn't have the right to live and work in the uk anymore this nomination system is a good way to see the connectivities of the art circle but later i realized i would like to have more curatorial influence into this space like i want to do group shows and i wanted to respond to certain thought and event by putting on an exhibition so then in the second year in 2019 we start curating group shows and then the pandemic came at the beginning we just felt so like what can we do for each other and you kind of feel a bit useless being in the art thinking like we're paying so much rent mm -hmm. to have that space empty it just felt so wrong so i think that was when shona uh, mentioned about some surgeons they were being kicked out by the landlord because they are working in nhs mm -hmm. right and we just both thought this is the opposite of like what <laughs> anyone should do we're just like why how <laughs> kind of just um, offer up our space to the people needed and quite a few people wrote us and it was it was until we actually received application I realized oh my god now I have to choose who to help and at the end like it make a lot of sense for the nurse to to move in for a bit I think this is the thing about artist led space I think you make your own decision even though the landlord got pissed off <laughs> I guess that's the consequences right but I think when it comes to more institutional thing, like you can't really make the decision. But really, what during the first lockdown, what does gallery have to offer?